Hello, I am here with another financial accounting class. We have covered last time the forms of accounting and other basic concepts of financial accounting like capital, sale, expenses and profit. Today we have talked about what is the difference between cash accounting and accrual accounting and what is the difference between capital expenses and revenue expenses and lastly we have discussed today what is the difference between cash in hand and profit but before starting our today's class I will share you a beautiful quote with you which is written by Charlie Munger he said, you have to know accounting. <clears throat> it is the language of practical business life. This quotation given us a message that we learn financial accounting and we are learning through this with VFFF Virtual Student Support Services YouTube channel. Our first point for today's class is the difference between cash accounting and accrual accounting. Cash accounting is the accounting system in which events are recorded when actual cash check is received or paid. Let's take an example of cash accounting. A company received electricity bill for the month of January on 12th February and paid 25th February. The company is recorded this bill in the month of February because the actual payment is made on the month of February. On the other hand, accrual accounting is the accounting system in which events are recorded as when they occur. Consider the previous example of electricity bill. The electricity is utilized in the month of January but the bill comes to the company in the month of February. So the expense should be recorded in the month of January according to the accrual accounting system. Because uh, we have consumed the electricity in the month of January instead of February. But on the other hand, in the cash accounting system, we have recorded this transaction in the month of February because actual payment has been made on in the month of February. And this is the difference between cash accounting and accrual accounting. Cash accounting when events are actually received or paid in terms of cash the transaction has been recorded in the cash accounting system. On the other hand in the accrual accounting system it is recorded when they occur. In the next point we have discussed about the difference between capital expenses and revenue expenses. Capital expenses are those expenses who provide benefit for the longer period of time. For example, Mr. Raza purchased a car of $100,000. The expenses of purchasing a car is considered as capital expenses because the benefit that the Mr. Raza is derived from the car for a longer period of time so that this transaction will be considered as capital expenditure or capital expenses. On the other hand, revenue expenses are those expenses who provide immediate benefit. The expenses for filling the petrol in it consider the revenue expenses. In the above example, when Mr. Raza purchasing a car of rupees hundred and thousand dollar is known as capital expenditure because Mr. Raza is deriving the benefit from car for a longer period of time. But on the other hand, when he fill the petrol in this car, this will treat it as revenue expenditure because he is getting benefit from this petrol immediately for a shorter period of time. 
that is the difference between capital expenditure and the revenue expenditure and the last point that we have discussed today is the difference between cash in hand and profit for the better understanding of the above concept difference between cash in hand and the profit we have taken an example for example a trader purchase some goods for a supplier for 1500 dollar and promise to pay in two weeks time the same day he sells these goods to the customer for rupees 2000 dollar who pays 1000 dollar on the same time and promise the remaining amount to pay the balance amount after one week now at the end of the day the trader has pay 1000 dollar to the supplier that is in his hand after reading this example a question arises in our mind that is is it 100000 dollar is our profit or it will be considered cash in hand the answer is no we not consider 1000 dollar our profit because he is still receiving 1000 dollar from his seller and pay the remaining of 500 dollar to the supplier so his actual profit is 500 dollar and has 1000 dollar in cash in hand on the first day when he sells the goods to the customer for 2000 dollar and receive 1000 dollar so 1000 dollar is the cash in hand and when he receive an other 1000 dollar after two weeks this will also consider if a cash in hand but from this 1000 dollar he will pay 500 to the supplier and the remaining 500 will be considered as profit so the real difference between cash in hand and the profit is the amount that we have in hand is known as cash in hand and the amount after detecting all the expenses from the cash in hand is considered as profit therefore we can say that cash in hand is different from the profit i think all of you understand today's topic keep watching virtual student support services channel for next class take care of your so we will stop our today's class here and meet in the new class with the new concept thank you